Earlbit Gases and Technologies has been around since 1919. There's currently a really, really high demand for skilled workers, especially welders. The current age of a welder is 55 on average, which means that coming up there's going to be a big wave of retirement with the baby boomers. The American Welding Society predicts that there's going to be 291,000 jobs left open by 2020. Right now, there's a really big mismatch between um, the very, very costly four-year degrees that you're going to get and then also the job opportunities that are associated with them. The difference with welding is that you can enter in the field and make a good amount of money even with just a few months of training. It is one-tenth of the investment to go to welding school compared to a four-year traditional college. Sometimes people don't have the time and the money to want to go back to a four-year college, but they do want to change in career. So welding is a really great place to start to look if you're thinking about changing industries. For someone that's looking for a new career or to upgrade their skill set, we have a great environment where we do teach everyone the skills and knowledge that they need, but we also bring a certain energy and passion to what we do. A normal day in our program will start out with classroom and theory. Uh, once you have a firm understanding of the theory of the process you'll be working on, then we take you out into the lab where you're going to be doing all hands-on. What makes us unique and different from other programs is the fact that we enjoy what we do. And we understand that us being here is an important role. We play an important role in people's lives and we take that seriously. I would recommend Earl Beck's welding training because they're, they're very good at what they do. They keep you wanting more. You want to come back, you know, after every class. Um, what I enjoyed most about the program was probably the easeability to have all the different materials and tools that I needed right on hand as much as I needed and definitely one-on-one -on -one instruction. If I had a question, it was broken down to me. If I still didn't understand it, it was broken down in another format and kind of helped make it easier to understand.